Hey there guys, Blood Panther here and welcome to Need for Speed 2015. We're back and today we're driving the McLaren. Finally, you say. I know, it's taken bloody ages and I don't know why because this car's like, it's, it's one of the most expensive cars. Usually like everybody's, oh, that's not the most expensive cars. Well, that's all they bloody do. But I... I'm a racer, as you know. And I love to do my lower end cars. So anyway, let's see what customizations this thing has. It has pointy bits and splitters. That's fine, because surely we've got a body kit right. That's... Okay, add, I added wheel arches, which is something. So let's throw on those wheel arches because they do look pretty damn nice. Everybody loves a wide body car. I don't know if there's just something about it. When you see it in the norm form and then they have bigger arches, it's just it just makes it a, bit, a million times better for some reason. One thing I really don't like about this kit, although it, like it's kind of cool in a way, I would personally prefer the whole thing to be wide body and not just like the little bit there. Like you've missed half the car. Whip, that looks pretty cool, actually. I take it back. I like both options. Let's do the suspension tuning right at the start. Otherwise, I'd probably get just as annoyed as Dan does from fan requests for the S13 in Forza. I had to throw that in somewhere. <laughs> now, look at it this way. We have a really, really nice car with a really, really, really nice wide body. We need a really, really nice wing. It just goes hand in hand, and I think this car deserves a big... There's two options. There's two options. We're going to go with that one because it's got bigger bits on the side. That's That looks fucking awesome. Now, go, I'm not going to lie. It's so annoying. There's like no side skirts. We make it lower side skirts or diffusers. We can put front pointy bits. We can't put front pointy bits on there because we put the body kit on. Now, I'm wondering like how far we can push the performance of this car. We don't have a lot of money, so we can't really do it now. But my point is like, can we do this? Can we push this thing even further? Because it already goes 204 miles an hour. The top speed is like 260, something like that. So I imagine throwing in an engine upgrade won't do as much as it would do with another car, like other like lower end cars. So if we throw this in, brings it to 230. See what I mean? That big 30 grand engine does bugger all. It's like putting a carbon grill on your car. Anyway, let's let's see. What do we do, what do we throw in? Do we throw in a turbo? Even an expensive turbo doesn't do anything. So I think to be honest with this build, I'm actually just gonna stick on the essentials, the differential, which isn't really an essential, but I'll call it an essential anyway. And the nitro system, which is an essential in Need for Speed. We'll go with action timed. Nitrous ti action timed. Let's go drift. That's not drift. That's drift. And you know what? I kind of want the noise. So we're gonna go with a turbo. So just for the noise. That's all I want it for. No, no other reason. Thankfully, they're both fucking disgusting. So <laughs> we're not gonna go with either of those. And I'm actually gonna keep it in this orange. So let's just fucking go. I'm actually keeping this thing tuned wise in the middle for now, just because I want to see what. Oh, oh. Oh my god! What? That was absolutely magnificent. I don't want to chew- I'm glad I didn't chew it, to be honest with you, because that was freaking beautiful. Look at that! Except the wall hits thing. That, that, was, that was my bad. I don't understand. I probably should just even tune cars in the future, because this is just absolutely magic. Oh my god! Though maybe, to be fair, it is, it is stock like 500, 600 horsepower, so, I mean... It's got, it's got, it's got the power to the back, if you know what I mean. Though it does seem to be struggling to lose the police. Though that may be because I'm driving like a bit of a professional trailer. Hey, there you go. Don't lose all the money that I have left from buying this McLaren. That's the thing. You, if you spend this much on a car, you want it to get away from the police. To be fair, in the UK, they only use Astras. And, and like, sometimes a Subaru, so I mean... It's not really going to be a problem there, but anywhere else, the traffic will fucking murder you. No. Why would I stay there? That's the opposite of what I wanted to. I've, I've, I've got to say, that wing looks freaking awesome. I'm so happy that it was like in the middle as it was rather than what I suggested. There, there should be an option for... Are you What is this made of? Sausage rolls? Uh, mm. I don't know, if I did tune it, I probably would have been like, oh yeah, it's alright, drifts a bit too much, too, too, too light, too, blah, 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 blah. because I would have made it a little bit more drift focused, because that's because that's just how you do. But I'm glad I didn't, because it turned out that this thing out of, out of the garage would slap on some drift tires and a custom diff and a turbo, and it goes like hellfire. I don't know why I've become northern all of a sudden. 
Fucking hell, love. I don't know what to do about these police, because they really won't fuck up. You know what, Theo? It might be good idea to leave the police area. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. I should probably stop going around the police area and actually make my way out of it. Yeah, just, just go further into it. I forgot this was a brilliant idea, wasn't it? No, it was. It was. It was. They weren't expecting that. They weren't expecting me to maneuver around. You bastard! Come with me! I mean, don't come with me, because of that, I mean, I won't be able to lose you. How about you piss off? Cheers, lads. In a bit. Wait, wait, wait. We're losing them, and we've probably lost them in the worst way possible, because we're going down this road, which will link back to the road we just came off of. That's just not the smartest idea in the world, is it? No. <laughs> no, it's not. Go! I mean, I don't know why I thought to run away as fast as possible, because that would make them come after me again. Not, not quite what I had in... Oh, no. Please. Oh, for God's sake. Listen here, mate. I know you're after some hollow dollars that I just, like, have left. The pennies I have left from some, from buying my McLaren. But I think we should fuck off. I can't find my way out of here. This is, this is, this is a trap. I have, I have no road. There we go. I found one. I think this, I think this leads out of here. Does it? Does it lead? It does. I'm a bad here. No. Oh, I, for God's sake, it doesn't. It leads down this road. Where's the exit? I'm trapped. It's a bit of a weird one because this McLaren, like, it's it's not the most exciting McLaren in the world. I thought they would add like, uh, I don't know, the P1. That's a bit, that's a bit like crazy, crazy for me. So that, that'd be like insane in the membrane, crazy for me for speed. But that would be pretty awesome. And uh, also maybe one of the, you know, I don't know, 675 LT. Uh, something like that. I was expecting something like that, but then, then we get live with this thing, and then it's like, hey, yeah, it's all right. Buy it for me grandson. Me, me grandson, the, the his birthday. Some for somehow I'm gonna pull out like 200 grand from my ass, but you know, it's all it's all we do. <laughs> what am I doing with my life? But I think we shall round it off there. It's an absolutely awesome handling car. We are getting what speed? Over 200 miles an hour, as it as it said on the on the page. All right, that's, that's how I want it to be. Just checking if it wasn't any less, although I. Just read the page and that's how far. All right. All right. That's just. That's that's marvelous. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy it, please be sure to leave this video a like. Subscribe if you are new and drive your McLaren off a cliff, you fucking squad. Peace. Okay.